formerly known as Google Hangouts, Google Meet is the new video communication service that is created by Google. It is one of the replacement applications together with Google Chat that will take over Google Hangouts. Good day sa aking mga viewers! In today's video, I'm going to continue my walkthrough tutorials in using video conferencing software. Nauna na nating nakita ang capabilities ng Zoom sa aking past video. But before we start, kung bago ka pa lang dito sa aking channel, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe, and don't forget to hit that notification bell. Malaking tulong talaga ang mga collaboration tools na galing sa Google. And now, let's try Google Meet. Siguro to, i-revise ko na lang depende sa comments ng client. Sabi niya lang naman kasi simple and impactful eh. Ay! Naalala ko nga pala. Sabi ng client ko gusto niya gamitin yung Google Meet para sa meeting namin bukas. Maangas to kasi pwede ko i-schedule sa Google Calendar in advance yung mga need ko para sa meeting na yun. Ayan, we're all set para sa meeting tomorrow with Mr. Peralta. Set na lang talaga ako ng alarm bago matulog. Ayan, okay na talaga itong logo na to. Sana magustuhan ito ng client ko. Meetings using the free version of Google Meet are only limited to 60 minutes. All users must have a Google account. It can be accessed using the browser, an Android, or even an Apple device. Mukhang busy pa ata si Mr. Peralta. Subukan ko nga siyang i-invite via email para ma-notify siyang sumali sa meeting na to. In Google Meet, you could join a meeting using a short link. You could also invite members through an email. Hala, I forgot. Meron pa pala akong kailangan asikasuhin. O sabi ko nga si Adria about sa pinapagawa kong loko. Ang bilis pa naman yung gumawa niya. Good morning, Mr. Peralta. Good morning, Adria. Um, kumusta nga pala yung project mo? Uh, I'm very glad to share po sa inyo na natapos na po namin yung unang draft ng pinapagawa ng loko. In a room or meeting of two persons, they can both present with screen sharing. It is also possible with using smartphones and not only with the browser. Adre, um, before you start presenting, Gusto ko lang ipaalam sa'yo na first time ko kasi gumamit ng Google Meet. Masanay kasi ako din sa Zoom. So, okay lang ba sa'yo na magtanong ako from time to time? Ah, uh, wala naman pong problema yun, Mr. Peralta. Compared to its rival Zoom, Zoom prevailed with 200 million users more, standing up against the 100 million of Google Meet. Um, Mr. Peralta, at ko lang po sa inyo kung pwede ko pong i-record tong Google Meeting natin ito para if ever na may mga suggestions or mga comments po kayo sa ginawa naming logo ay hindi ko po makakalimutan. Ah, so pwede palang mag-record ng meeting dito kagaya sa Zoom. Okay, sige, go ahead. Thank you po, Mr. Peralta. Recording meetings are possible with the application Google Meet. There is an Ask Consent pop-up that will appear once you want to start recording. Mr. 
Mr. Peralta, ay papakita ko na po yung ginawa kong burger. Proofs, green sharing, magpapresent po ako. Wow! How did you do it so accurately? Ganito talaga yung naisip ko na logo ng company ko. Uh, ginamit ko lang naman po yung description nyo sa kung paano mo magiging itsura ng logo. Um, luckily, we did it so accurately na nag-match po sa inyong gusto. Um, Mr. Peralta, favor lang po. Um, pwede pong pakicheck kung yung audio po na inyong ginagamit ay galing sa inyong headset. Nagmumukha po ko kung galing sa inyong computer. Hindi po masyadong malinaw. Okay, sige. Uh, give me a minute. Without difficulty, freely choose your microphone or speaker device. You can also check the sound of your speakers by clicking test. Ah, uh, mas clear na ba? Ah, uh, yes po, Mr. Peralta. Mas okay na po siya kaysa kanina. Ah, um, feeling ko may problema yung headphone ko. Kasi sa'yo rin kasi, uh, medyo mahina yung audio. Paano kaya to? Ah, uh, kung ganun po yung problema na na-experience nyo, pwede nyo pong i-on yung turn-on captions para if every month po na mawawala yung audio namin, meron pa rin po kayong nababasa sa kung ano yung sinasabi namin. Ah, so kipag din pala yung Google Meet sa ano eh. Yes po, Mr. Peralta. If you find the audio quality while using Google Meet is unclear, you can try using closed captions for easier listening or communication. It will act as subtitles to the speaker in the current meeting. Um, going back po sa main agenda natin, Mr. Peralta, ano po palang mga comments nyo dun sa mga logo na ginawa na? Um, sobrang nagustuhan ko talaga. Uh, kasi bet ko talaga yung mga simple graphics na gulaw po yung pinag-uusapan. Napakahalaga pong feedback niyan, Mr. Peralta. Maraming salamat po. But I think it could still be improved. Uh, pwede mo ba akong bigyan ng copy nito ito, uh, bagong design mo? Para at least uh, kung meron akong free time, pwede ko siyang tingnan tapos maisip ko yung mga pwede pang pagbukit. Sige po, Mr. Peralta. I'll send it to you later po. Gamit tong Google Calendar na nadadirect din po sa Google Meet. Okay, sige. You have a personal file cabinet while using Google Meet. Prepare them beforehand meetings and send them in an instant. Hala, malapit na pala maubos yung data ko sa araw na to. Baguhin ko nga yung video quality para mababa lang yung data consumption ko. Inconsistent internet connection has been a problem here in the Philippines. Changing the definition of your video quality will be of great help to the user. The user can either choose HD or SD quality for both send and receive resolution. To use the least amount of data, you can select audio only. Um, ano po pala yung mga comments nyo regarding sa ating design? Um, actually, yung design okay neto kasi simple lang. Pero I think mas magiging okay siya pag mukha siya uh, 3D, yung parang naka-3D yung logo. Uh, we'll make sure na magagawa po namin yung iba't ibang portion na nais nice nito. Thank you po, Mr. Peralta, sa comments niya regarding sa ating logo. I'll do my best po to give justice sa mga nabigay niyo pong mga feedback and suggestions. Um, o siya, Andre, mauna na ako kasi meron pa kasi akong online training. Uh, update mo na lang ako pag meron ka ng bagong design. Okay, bye-bye. Thank you. Thank you po, Mr. Peralta. Maraming salamat din po. for our video today. Napaka-useful talaga ng collaboration tools from Google. Makakatulong to sa productivity, mapa student man or employee. I hope you are all doing well sa inyong mga tahanan. Stay healthy and always be informed. This is Sermon Peralta, your IT companion. See you again next time for another technological adventure. Bye!